Hello everyone and welcome to Vlogmas Day 2! So today I'm going to a Christmas market but first it's time for the second one which is... where is it? Here! Santa Claus? I did something really freaking dumb because I forgot to bring my tripod which means that this camera, well you, <laughs> might fall down but let me just very quickly tell you what's up so I'm gonna be going to a Christmas market um, after picking up my friend so right now I'm on my way to Rotterdam to pick up my friend and then we're going to a Christmas market that's two and a half hours away um, yeah, so let's go pick her up. Hi guys, so, and I wanted to show both you and my friend something. So obviously the sun is shining right now. So usually when the sun is shining and you can't see, you wear sunglasses. Well, I have the funniest sunglasses ever because this is my dad's car. And hold on. <laughs> Everyone, so as you can see, we have made it to the Christmas market. It was a uh, very hard to do so, to do so. Generally, we walked how long? Away? Half an hour? Yeah, exactly. Well, we stopped. We stopped to go to use the bathroom. We also went to a uh, candy store because I really wanted to get vegetables and try them out. We also went to, we also went to Miniso. And I just ended up getting some like Japanese chocolate buns and keychains, keychains. And we got matching keychains. Okay. It's a Hello Kitty one. And Hello Kitty. Hello Kitty. And let's just go walk around. Okay, okay, okay. 
So we ended up getting some fruit. So this is a strawberry and banana covered in chocolate, and this is just strawberry. Oh, good year, folks. by buying these and we bought a cow. Wait. She bought a cow and I bought a bear. And these are going to a charity called Stichting de Knuffel in the Netherlands. What it does is kind of like a Dutch version of Make-A-Wish. So I will link the website down below. They sadly don't have an Instagram, but I will link their website down below in case you want to donate to charity. Okay guys, so I think we've reached the end of the Christmas market and sadly there were no chestnuts. <laughs> there were no chestnuts. There were no chestnuts, so we're going to go home now. So yes. Hi. So these are the keychains. Oh, I had them wrong. And now we have matching keychains and matching pictures. Happy, happy, happy. Meow, 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 meow. Can I catch you? Yeah, it's very slippery, so it's a code yellow, which means that it's going to. It's it is raining, but it's also freezing, so it's going to be extremely slippery. So I do have to be careful. But let's review the Christmas fair. We said market the whole video, but it's not a market. It's a fair. Okay, so Google Maps is right now saying two hours and twelve minutes. Okay, so it should not it's be three shorter. hours. It's shorter. Yeah, okay. okay, so vibe. I think it was pretty gezellig. Uh, How do you say? <laughs> Where's out? There. No. It's not erg. Observant. A whole. Oh, outrit. Finally. Woo! Happy, happy, happy. So the vibe, she said, was pretty good. There were a lot of people. Uh, that's, that's, like, busyness. that's the busyness too. There yeah. were a lot of people. I'm thinking it's because like it's the second of December and this is like the first Christmas market, one of the first Christmas markets open right now. The food, there were no chestnuts. There were no chestnuts. And that is the I'm upset. Yeah, and that's the exact thing that we were looking for. That's I've, like the Christmas fair staple. I've never had chestnuts. And she said they're very good, and I was looking forward to trying them, but not lucky today. There were also no olibola. There were no olibola. So in the Netherlands, we have something called olibola, which is a very Dutch thing, and it's, and it's literally just fried dough. The vibe was like, it was, it was great. Yeah. There were children everywhere just running around. There was one, one there child was one, like, with, with a flute, but it sounded like, trompets. like a trumpet. <laughs> How do you say that one? Trumpet! <laughs> Stars. Stars could have been better, I'm gonna be honest. Um, there were a few with like cute stuff. Yeah, um, but it made me like. It, it reminded me of the Hague Market, which I've been there often, and it's like. It's just basic like stuff, it's not like Christmas related. When I went to Germany to Dusseldorf, their Christmas market had a lot of handmade stuff by the people themselves and that like genuinely brings a different vibe to it. So that's what I want to say about the vibe too. Like it was there were good people, but so out of five I would give this Christmas fair from Maastricht a three. For me it's a three. Yeah. So maybe a 2.5 because it seemed big like size we didn't we didn't uh, discuss the 
the side. Yeah, but the it side. seemed big, but there was like this skating ring, like in the middle of it, which was like 15% yeah. of the entire fair. Hey guys, so I'm finally home now. It was a very long drive to and a very long drive from, but regardless, it was very, very fun. We will be going to a second Christmas fair. We don't know which one yet. I really enjoyed it. This was my first Christmas fair I went to independently because the first one I went to was with high school and it was to practice German, which I didn't do because I was too shy. Oh, the Christmas tree makes me so happy. If you liked the video, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel to not miss any other Vlogmas episode. And let me know if you're going to a Christmas fair down in the comments below. Aside from that, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Much love.